Greetings, fine people of the internet. I'm Eric Surf Six. Welcome to Eric Meal Time. And in this episode, it's going to be the food from Belarus. Oh yeah, let's check it out. Home cooking from Belarus. Yeah, Minsk is the capital of Belarus. Where in the world is Belarus? I think it is really close to Russia and maybe next to Poland. I think it's a landlocked country. Never been there, but I'm gonna eat their food. The first dish looks like a gorgeous dessert. Desserts first? No. This is marinated herring and beetroot salad. That's what this is. Wow, look at the layers. Beautiful looking. So the herring's on the bottom, it looks like the fish, and then the beetroot on the top. Try a bunch of salad with it. There's a pretty good bite. Well, it's salty, it's pickly. <laughs> The taste is almost overpowering. The herring is pleasant, but I think the beetroot is just a little bit too powerful. What else am I tasting? Potatoes, perhaps? But I think by volume, there's more beetroot than anything else, and it's very, very tart. Powerful flavors going on here. The dish is called Salvadka Pod Lapoy. Shuboy. I'll put it in the description. Looks like we have some mixed pickles here. Lots of different kinds of pickles. Some onions, some mushrooms. Maybe there are no pickles here. <laughs> it looks like a mushroom dish. Pickled mushrooms? It's like all mushrooms. Hmm. All right. Mmm. -hmm. They're chilled. Look at all the different types of mushrooms in here. Mmm. -hmm. It's very refreshing. Five or six different types of mushrooms in here. It's in a very mellow sauce. It's good. This next dish is called Zrezi. It sounds crazy. It's potatoes and liver inside. Don't know how I feel about that. Liver inside. Let's see. Let's go in for a look. Mashed potatoes and liver. And a sauce on top. And it's baked. Baked nicely. Oh, these are the creamiest potatoes ever. Goodness, so buttery. I didn't get much meat in that one, almost none. I'm not a big liver fan, but look, you can see all the liver right there. Oh, goodness. With the liver, you gotta go big or you gotta go home. I think I'm going home. That's a lot of liver. It's actually pretty good liver. It's cooked pretty well. And it's not that pungent. It's not a real, real heavy flavor. More of a pate. Mm -hmm. It's fabulous, but these potatoes. Oh my. It's beautiful how they can hold the mashed potatoes together like this. And it's baked on the bottom and top. Beautiful dish. The potatoes are good for sure. To drink, we've got a vodka-based Bloody Mary. Oh yeah, it's been a long time since I've had one of these. How does it taste? <sighs> Tomato juice and vodka. That's about it. Mm -hmm. No spices in here, but that's okay. I can taste the vodka. 
That's what I'm here for. There's definitely at least a shot or two possibly in here. The vodka, you can definitely taste it. Mm. Look at this lovely dish. It's called Gorshak. It's a pot stew with buckwheat and some mushrooms inside. Oh, it's crunchy. Oh, I can smell the mushrooms. And there's the buckwheat. Mmm. It's very mushroomy. And it tastes like a rice dish, the buckwheat. Oh, look at the view. We've got a little bit of Tokyo Tower here. Not bad. Tokyo Tower from the window. <laughs> that's looking pretty good. Yeah. Well, the view's a nom nom nom, that's for sure. Look at that. You can see about two thirds of it. This dish is called machanka. It's a sour cream pork stew, and it comes with crepes. There's one crepe, but that's... <laughs> I don't think you wrap it inside. Just eat it together. Home cooking from Belarus. The sour cream is very mellow. It's really more like a gravy. It's not very sour. It's good meat though. Nice tender stew meat. Look at this beautiful dish. It's paprika stuffed with meat. <laughs> we lift off the lid. Love the presentation. Almost looks too good to eat. Stuffed with meat and sauce. <laughs> oh, look at that. I'm not playing with it. Just trying to get it out. Look at the thickness of the soup. It's buttery. Look at that. A lot of dairy in here, it looks like. Stuffed paprika. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm -hmm. Lots of flavors going on here. I'm not sure what kind of meat this is, but it's delicious. Lots of veggies in there. Can't identify the meat, not sure what it is. Ooh. It's a nice creamy paprika. Yeah, I like that. Mmm. Mm -hmm. That is really tasty. I think the paprika is the best part. That is fabulous. Mm. Fun eats. Belarus, everybody. Belarus. It's time for dessert. This is called charlatka. It's a cinnamon apple cake, and then it comes with a brandy tea. Fancy schmancy. Lovely presentation, huh? Home cooking, boy. I don't know. They're doing a pretty good job for home cooking. Cut. Let's lay it down into the chocolate. We get a bit of cream on there. Oh, yeah. Love that cinnamon apple flavor. Very mature taste. It's gingerbread like. Yeah, nice soft cake, spongy. This is some good cake. It really it tastes like gingerbread to me. But that's the cinnamon and the apple. Mm. Let's try the brandy tea. Ooh! 
this definitely engages the sinuses. Mm -hmm. That is very nice. Very nice by Ruffle Tea. It's got a hint of lemon, a hint of peach, perhaps a bit of brandy, but just delicious taste in tea. So I guess it's time to rate this home cooked meal. I'm thinking home cooking. I haven't had home cooking like this in a long, long time. I gotta go full six on this one. Yeah, the tastes were lots of unexpected things, but everything was pretty delightful. So on my ranking scale, that's a nom, a nom, a nom. That's the highest ranking. So I'm giving away three of my get some snack packs. If you're not familiar, I'll put a link right up here. You can check out what's inside. And the only thing you need to do is put a comment down below on this video and you'll be entered for your chance to win. I will announce three winners in the next Eric Mealtime. So thank you guys for watching. Give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and we'll see you in the next one. Hey, thanks for making it all the way to my end screen. So now what? Well, click around, watch a few more videos. How about checking out my Patreon account? Links are all right there on the screen. Cheers and beers, team. Get some. <laughs>